Hello everyone, in today's lectures we are going to discuss about the relationship between moment and curvature for column and shear wall. So the data has been taken from ETAB software and uh, the graph has been drawn in Excel sheets. So we are just opening ETABs. So this, this building we have designed and we are just going to define sections and click the section properties frame section click this column modify or for this time I'll click this column modify click on section designer and the moment curvature uh, curve data select show table and select this one export to Microsoft Excel this data will be export to Excel sheet this data has been exported here as we can see this was another one this data has been exported so this is the data for moment and this column is showing the data for curvature you just click here and going to insert and click this scatter bubble select data Add and give the name of moment curvature this one and select data for x direction for x axis it will be the curvature select this column enter remove this and select the data for moment here in y axis and ok again ok change the chart type so this one okay this is the interaction curve for column give add chart element and axis title for horizontal and axis title for vertical name it give a name moment kilo newton meter and this axis also Curvature radian by mm millimeter. So this is the interaction. So this is the moment curvature relationship for column. So now again draw the moment curvature relationship for shear wall pier sections. Now we are just going again for items. Remove or cancel this one. And we are just going for shear wall pier section, define general pier section, and we just click the data for example for this pier sections and click modify show pier section, section designer, and show moment curvature data, show table, and export this to Microsoft Excel. As we have done in, in case of column this data has been transferred we just expand this sheet and we have the data for momented curvature we just select here and going for insert select scatter bubble right click select data add give a name for moment curvature or here We give a name give a series name as the table this one moment curvature data select here select uh, the data for x-axis which is curvature select this whole column and enter remove this one and select the data for y and enter ok again ok so and just make some arrangement change chart type select this one and ok so and give the add chart element for axis title horizontal and 
axis title vertical give a name moment moment kilonewton meter also for x axis it is curvature and radian by mm by the meter so this is uh, the moment curvature relationship for uh, shear wall pier sections and we can also draw for other pier sections for example we are just going to select uh, this pier section for example this pier sections and modify show section designer and we are going for moment curvature curve or another one it is not showing very well so i will for i will draw for for example for this one for this one i will draw okay for this one show modify section moment curvature show data export to excel so the data has been transferred to excel sheet so we have the data for moment curvature and apply the same procedure as we have done in previous uh, moment uh, moment curvature relationship select scatter bubble and select uh, select data add give us your name this table select x-axis uh, values and select the curvature and enter erase this data or value and select for y as a moment ok and ok select uh, change chart type select this one and ok and give a uh, axis titles for horizontal and axis title for vertical give a name moment kilometer meter okay kilometer meter and here give a name as curvature radian by perimeter okay this is another moment curvature relationship for shear wall pier sections okay and we can draw for other pier sections or other column section as well we just Take a different uh, data just applying and uh, following the same procedures we will draw another moment and coverage relationship for that section same as for columns we also can take for other columns okay so uh, it was uh, the lecture for how to draw the momented curvature relationship for columns and shear wall thank you so much for your attention hope this video will be uh, in, uh, useful for you all and hope you subscribe the channel for upcoming and providing good videos and good lectures for you all thank you so much have a good time